I'm Mix Alfonso. I'm Jessica JJ Raybone. And I'm Eddie Neptune Eskridge, and you're watching Celeb Secrets for You. Backstage, so you think you could dance the first live show. I know there was so much anticipation for it, but now it's over. So, how was your experience tonight? Excitement, ready to give it all next week, and you know, just soak it in. The experience was amazing because seeing it like on TV is different from being here live and stepping on the stage live. You feel all the energy, especially from the audience and then from the dancers that's on stage with you. It just brings a different atmosphere than watching it. I was just so, so thankful for this opportunity given to us, you know, like such an amazing pe group of people dancing together. So, so thankful. And what was it like uh, in the rehearsal studio for you guys? Because I know it was a little crazy with the first week. It was like, Let's sleep, keep rehearsing until we pass out, and it's it's a challenge, but like we have to be prepared for that, you know, and see the feeling of like how the re the other seasons were, like how they went through. But I'm excited that uh, Twitch is with us as a mentor and guide us through, you know. It's it's been a huge help for us. It's been crazy. I'm gonna be perfectly <laughs> honest. <laughs> <laughs> it's been crazy because like we re rehearse so sometimes we have call times at like 6 30 or 7 in the morning we'll stay there for like 12 14 hours learning three four different dances and still have to perform them which in a time frame of like seven six days you know um, this time it's going to be shorter of course because we're going to start on uh, Wednesday but it's been crazy you're learning more than one dance and then you have to perfect it and connect with the audience and connect with the dancers that you're dancing with Hardest part for me is not knowing the exact schedule. They don't tell us yeah. exactly what's don't. gonna happen. All they tell you guys is like just 6.30 lobby. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> we get there, stretch. Okay. <laughs> now dance, okay. <laughs> and you don't know how many hours that rehearsal is, how much time you have for the break to go into the next rehearsal. Yeah. So it's like, you know, I'm half Japanese. I'm very like, let's go on time, you know, knowing what's going on. So it, that's the hardest part for me, actually. So now, if you guys could, I know next week everyone's going to be doing different types of dance. So one type of dance maybe that you guys would want to do that's outside of your normal, what, what would it be? Um, my side is contemporary, so I'm really excited next week that I'm doing. So I'm ready to show everybody, like, the ups, upsides of me of being, like, raw. But now I'm going to, like, let it go. So I'm really excited. I have to honestly say Broadway, which that's what I'm about to do, because I've studied it a little bit before coming here. I got inspired by a couple of people that my girlfriend showed me on YouTube, like Bob Fosse. So I think it'll be really good to actually try this out and be into that character. I actually wanted to try like partnering. I've been going to salsa clubs and like having fun and stuff, and I love it. So I got jazz this time, but hopefully in the future I'll get some partnering. Do you guys have a message for your fans because they're going to be voting for you tonight and every other Monday. So, what's your message to them? Everybody together. <laughs> That's not going to happen. <laughs> See how go ahead. Yeah, like, like what? Uh, what? <laughs> no, go, go ahead. Oh well, thank you so much for all the support and you know messages and tweets and share and everything. Like we really appreciate your support. So, vote for us. <laughs> <laughs> Team Street, Team Street, Squad, Team Street, Squad, 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 Squad. squad. <laughs> <laughs>